Hey guys, Glitchy here, and welcome to today's guide, where I will address how to obtain the Ability Ace Trophy. The trophy states that you will need to unlock and equip all available support and spirit abilities. And yes, this includes the XP0 ability, only available in Proud and Critical. A clever way to actually have a difficulty related trophy in the game. Sneaky bastards. Anyway, you don't need any stat boosting abilities for this matter, so I will only focus on what's necessary. As one of the guys who thought it would be a great idea to start on standard or beginner to have a nice and easy platinum trophy and make my way onto critical afterwards, I couldn't have been more wrong. But already having the necessary spirits makes a trip an easy one. Nonetheless, I will still address where to find the necessary spirits in the description, so don't worry about it. I also know there are more spirits that can be used, but my research powers proved these to be the quickest and cheapest if you should start proud or critical just for this trophy. I will have a list of the required spirits, the required LP for each spirit, the required amount of links, and if they need a special disposition, in the description below. If you're starting the game on Proud just for this trophy, finish the tutorial on both characters and head to the Colosseum. To obtain money quickly, you can battle outside the Colosseum in Traverse Town and drop into the other character to convert droplets into money. Grab that item that you can buy with droplets for even more money. To get there faster, sell your stuff that you won't need, keeping only the water barrels, ice cream cones and chocolates. The chocolates and ice cream cones are useful to change the disposition of spirits. Electricorn eats ice cream to change while Ryu Dragon, Fin Fatal and Fruit Cats want chocolate for that. Then proceed to drop into a world that has the Moogle Bargain Forecast. This will reduce the barrel cost by 20%. Now buy some water barrels and open your spirit bonding screen. I learned this trick from Limit472. So props to him for teaching me this. I will also post a link to his guide in the description below. Just use water barrels and then quit the instant the game has started to acquire LP. Finishing the game normally yields more LP, but in the long run this is faster. Start by leveling the spirits in the order listed in the description. It will make things much much faster leveling in that order. Keep an eye on the LP that you gain and LP that is necessary. That way you can switch spirits earlier for a better run. The approximate amount of LP gained per barrel is 15-ish, but this can be more or less, so that's why you better keep track on how much you actually gain every usage. When you need the link a couple of times, just put that spirit in your party and let him attack the nightmare nightmares for you until the link gauge is filled. Then proceed to link with the spirit and immediately cancel. If you are fast enough you can instantly link again, or have him attack just one more time and then link again. Repeat until the required link times are hit, but remember to unlock the gate first, else your link count will not drop if there is still an unlockable before the gate. Equipping all of the acquired abilities and the XP0 ability will pop the Ability Ace Trophy. If this was your final one, like it was for me, your nice and shiny platinum will pop right there. My name is Glitchy, I hope this guide was informing for you. Leave a like, comment and subscribe for more Kingdom Hearts news and guides. See you next time.